Hi, Vanity Fair. I'm Tara Strong. I'm an actress mostly known for my animated voiceover roles, like Raven from Teen Titans, and Bubbles from the Powerpuff Girls, and Timmy Turner from the Fairly Odd Parents, and Harley Quinn, and Twilight Sparkle, uh, and Baby Doe, and Truffles from Chowder, and a whole bunch more. Today, I'm going to make up some voices and improvise from characters that I've never seen before. The beauty of animation, when you get an audition, they'll give you a character description. So because we're not getting that, I'm going to have to make that up from my head. I think when I look at it, I see a little boy. And I'm going to pretend that they said he thinks he's really tough, but he's not that tough. And he's missing some teeth. And he tries to fly into action, but he's a little chub, so he slips and falls a lot. But he really wants to be part of the team. Hey, you guys, wait for me. I'm going to take off now. Here I go. Wait a second. I'm going to try that again. Can we do, like, the superhero thing, take two? Oh, they left again. Oh, if you had a really low, scratchy voice, somewhere around here, you'd still want to, like fight crime and say like get out of my way i like this thing i don't know what it is sometimes it's fun to go like off initial thought like maybe this is the prettiest this species comes in like maybe she's just beautiful and when she speaks she sings and she loves life and all her tentacles she just wants to be your best friend or she could be Somebody down here that just thinks she's really pretty, but she's kind of gross. <laughs> and she kind of makes these yucky sounds when she moves. <laughs> this is sort of a Mario type character, I guess. I actually played Hip and Hop in the original animated series. They were these little Koopa guys like this. So he could always do a little voice like that. He could be somebody like that. That's what I think when I look at him. But if he's a little bit older, we can make him like that. And maybe he talks like that. And maybe he's Italian. Maybe he's ready to make some spaghetti, but not with the mushroom. We just want to be the fun guy. Oh, they're so cute. Oh my gosh, I love them. I love owls. They're so cool. Maybe the girl owl sounds like this. Or she could be a little older, too. This would be one of those things where... If they didn't specify in the audition her age, I would call my agent and go, why didn't they put the age on this character? Because the drawing could be like a child, could be an old lady. I don't know. I'd have to know before I did this audition. But if she was a little older, maybe she'd say, wow, we've been married for 400 years and he's still pretty cute. <laughs> and he could be like this guy. I still love her, too. She's my little darling. <laughs> Let's say that maybe she's from England, and she's going to kick some butt with her tribe, who she loves very much, and she really doesn't like this guy Bill that keeps flirting with her. She might actually shoot Bill in the face with her arrow. That might be fun. She might not be British. She could be, though. She could be Irish. She's wearing green. That might be fun. She's just ready to kick some butt. Let's go, then. <laughs> uh, this lady looks like she needs some sleep. I've been there. You know, she's uh, she's tired. She's retired. She's just bored with life in general. She hates her husband. He smells and farts a lot. She's just ready for the day. Maybe life to be over. She's like very anti germ so if somebody delivers something... <laughs> She'd probably get even more sick and then she'd be really cranky. She doesn't let anybody in during COVID. Yeah, so this is like a groovy little alien dude. Maybe he's like a... Maybe he's like the DJ at some alien club. Yo, dudes, we're ready to mix some tunes. Come on in, get your groove on. Yeah. Oh, here comes the bad guys. His, like, table tune thing turns into, like, some really cool guns and he gets the bad guys. More of a mama's boy, he'd sound like, Yeah, I guess I could play some tunes for you. Mom, did you pack my lunch? She's somebody that goes through life a little bit slower. She definitely needs some sleep and maybe some nighttime tea. But sometimes when she counts sheep, 
they like bother her and then she dreams about them she hates that she's not a happy-go-lucky kind of girl i mean it could be we could have caught her at a bad moment i mean we could give her a break like tomorrow morning after her coffee we could revisit her this is pretty straightforward if you're gonna see this in an animated audition she's gonna sound just like this and that's her voice. It's just very sweet and very authentic, and she's probably going to get quiet in certain moments and be excited for her birthday in other moments, and maybe she'll get to sing, but she always has to be authentic and bright-eyed and hopeful. If they specified that she can act like she's the good girl, but really she's the mean girl, <laughs> it might come out secretly off to the side with her little mean giggles. <laughs> I'm going to mess that girl up. He's just ready to go. He's ready to go with his rollerblades. Maybe he's got a little bit of a lisp. He's not quite as polished as the other kids, but he tries really hard. He's like, I'm ready to go. Oh, oh. Well, I'm ready to go. <laughs> oh. Improv is so important in animation. I tell every hopeful to take improv class because it really helps with your confidence to know how to create characters, to trust your gut, to trust your instincts. Oftentimes you'll be working on a show as a regular established character and they'll say now we need her to be a little bit younger now we need her to be a little bit chubbier now we need to, to her to have braces now we need her to be from england now we need her to be a boy and you have to be ready to do all of the above and if you've taken improv classes you're going to have a lot more confidence to slide into a bunch of different roles i'm tara strong and that was my take on some new character voices that came without descriptions please put good descriptions in all your auditions thanks